Adobe Photoshop is a registered trademark of Adobe Systems Incorporated and I am in no way affiliated with Adobe. Okay, so on this tutorial I'm actually not going to be talking too much on color inverse but I'm going to be talking about the gamut warning and it kind of works with what we just did here uh, with the saturation. So the gamut warning is up here on your view and you can see it right down here, gamut warning. And my battery is going to die. Uh, okay, hit view and hit gamut warning as you can see. Uh, and the it's shift command Y or shift control Y on PC. So hit gamut warning. As you can see, all this gray stuff um, kind of just popped up as you can see right there. And what this is, it's warning you that stuff is oversaturated in your image and it's the print quality is not going to be as great as you want it to be. So this is kind of a neat way to um, help you out with your prints and make them look a whole bunch better. And sometimes people oversaturate it and wh when you get your print back it looks kind of funny. So what we're going to do is I'm actually going to teach you how to get rid of stuff that's oversaturated and with Photoshop it helps you um, retain good quality. So basically on this tutorial I just wanted to show you what the gamut warning does and it's going to bring up this gray uh, grayish look here and I'm going to show you how to get rid of that here in just a second.